Today, we're diving into a comprehensive comparison between the brand new X Real One and the ever popular Veecher Pro. Both promise a futuristic AR experience, whether it's for gaming, watching movies, or exploring spatial computing, and they aim to solve the problem of accessible, immersive technology without the hefty price tag of something like the Apple Vision Pro. The X Real One boasts cutting edge onboard features, while the Veecher Pro offers lightweight versatility and customization. But the big question is, which one is best for your needs and style? Well, let's dive into a detailed comparison of these two AR glasses and see which one is the right choice for you. And if you find this video helpful, please help out the channel by giving it a like and subscribing. Let's start with the design, because the AR glasses need to be as practical as they are stylish. The Xreal one stands out with its sleek, all-black design and impressively thin lenses. These glasses strike a great balance between subtlety and functionality, making them low-profile enough to wear in public without attracting attention. On the other hand, the Vitra Pro is slightly lighter, which may not sound like a big deal, but that 0.2-ounce difference can add up when it comes to ear fatigue over extended use. The Vitra Pro also has adjustable myopia control dials on each lens, allowing users to fine-tune their viewing experience without additional prescription lenses. While both options are comfortable and well-built, the Xreal One's sleek design gives it the edge for those who value subtlety and elegance. On the other hand, if adjustability and lightweight wear are your top priorities, the Vitcher Pro might be the better choice. Moving into the displays. Both glasses use Sony's Micro OLED displays, delivering vivid colors and excellent contrast ratios that make content pop. But the X Real One edges ahead with its slightly wider field of view at 50 degrees, compared to the Vitur Pro's 45 degrees. This subtle difference reduces fringing around the edges of the screen and creates a more immersive experience. The X Real One also supports a larger virtual screen size, projecting up to 147 inches compared to Vitur's 135 inches. While these numbers might seem close on paper, they translate to a noticeable difference when you're watching movies or gaming. Both glasses use similar prism display tech, ensuring sharp and vivid visuals, but Xreal's enhanced field of view and larger screen size make it the better choice for immersive content consumption. If you're someone who values a cinema-like experience, the Xreal One's display performance will not disappoint. When it comes to audio, there's a clear winner. While most AR glasses offer basic built-in speakers, Xreal has gone above and beyond with its audio quality. The sound is not only loud and clear, but also has a surprising amount of bass, making it ideal for gaming and movie watching. On the other hand, the Vitur Pro delivers a more standard audio experience that gets the job done but doesn't stand out. It's worth noting that both models benefit from pairing with headphones in noisy environments like planes, but if you're relying on the glasses' built-in audio, the Xreal One offers a superior experience. Whether you're gaming, streaming, or simply watching a YouTube video, Xreal's audio quality ensures you're fully immersed in your content. Moving on to the performance. At the heart of Xreal's offering is the X1 chip, which brings a host of onboard features to the glasses themselves. Unlike most AR glasses, which rely heavily on connected devices and apps for AR functionality, Xreal One integrates these capabilities directly into the glasses. You can adjust the color temperature, brightness, and contrast without needing additional software, and it even supports a 32 by 9 ultra-wide display for an expansive viewing experience. The X1 chip also enables three degrees of freedom tracking, which stabilizes the image and ensures a smooth experience, even during turbulence on a flight. On the other hand, the Vitcher Pro requires external apps like Nebula to unlock its AR features, which can feel less seamless. While Vitcher is working on a neckband computer to enhance its spatial computing capabilities, it's not available yet. For those who want a truly integrated AR experience, the X Real One is the clear winner in this category. Software and ecosystem are another crucial consideration. The X Real One offers additional functionality through its Beam Pro device, which provides an even smoother and more immersive AR experience. But the Beam Pro is an optional accessory that costs an extra $200. On the other hand, Viture Pro's Nebula app is free and delivers some of the same features directly to your phone. Additionally, Vitur's upcoming neckband computer promises to expand its AR capabilities significantly, but since it's not yet available, it's hard to factor that into the current comparison. 
While the X-Real ecosystem might involve additional costs, it offers a more polished and reliable experience overall. If you're looking for a future-proof option with seamless integration, X-Real's ecosystem is the way to go. As for my final verdict, both the X-Real One and Viture Pro are fantastic AR glasses that bring a lot to the table. The Viture Pro's lightweight design, adjustable myopia dials, and free Nebula app make it a strong contender, especially for those who prioritize comfort and cost-effectiveness. But the X-Real One stands out with its sleek design, superior display quality, outstanding audio performance, and integrated features powered by the X1 chip. It delivers a more complete and immersive AR experience, making it the better choice for most users. If you're looking for AR glasses that combine cutting-edge technology with practicality, the X-Real One is the clear winner.